Hello, welcome back to another episode of Lana Can't Talk. Enjoy. Hey lads, in today's video we're going to be doing another towny makeover and today we are making over the Tinker family from Eco Lifestyle. If you've watched, you know, the two parts of my Eco Lifestyle Let's Play, I know, wild, uh, that pack's been out for a good while now, uh, you'll know that I am obsessing over this sim right now. And I love these sims so much. They are literally, okay, you know, like how we say, like, you know, Bella Goth and Mama Goth, they're like the iconic couple and like they're like the power couple. <laughs> no, step over loves. No, 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 it's the Tinkers. They are way better. And I'm obsessed with these sims. They are both so cute. I love them so much i also want to do another video aging up olive their child and giving her a makeover so i'll definitely do that soon but yeah so we're starting off with tina tinker what a great name um so this sim i've actually already seen a lot this is the sim i obsessed over a bunch um but yeah i've already seen that and she's so cute honestly i feel like she looked better before because like her style is just so cute and i feel like yeah i did a really good job with her which is shocking to say honestly never thought i'd say that in my life but i feel like they did do a good job so well done yeah you actually did a good job on a sim i'm so proud of you um but anyways yes yeah, so she is so cute i love her style and everything so she's very like colorful in my opinion like she had like blue eyeliner or something on before so i wanted to keep in with that sort of style but just sort of make it you know cc like and obviously give her a makeover it's kind of the whole point um so i gave her this really cute rainbow um eyeshadow it is the last uh day of pride so happy pride i'm sorry like i, I guess i don't really know i don't i haven't done anything specific to pride but i feel like a lot of my sims uh, are lgbtq plus so yeah but um basically yeah so she is i i don't even know much about her honestly i'm literally reading her like wiki right now because i don't know much about these sims like so she's apparently a freelance crafter which is cool she's a perfectionist a maker and gloomy and she wants to be a master crafter no a master maker master maker oh my god like mr maker does anyone else remember mr maker honestly what an icon do you know that kid's show when he was like kind of creepy what a, what a bloody icon and it, was that the one with like the songs he was wasn't it like with i'm a, i'm square i'm triangle you know what i'm on about you probably don't this is really embarrassing anyways <laughs> uh, so she has apparently she has black eyes um but i did her eyes as brown honestly cc eyes make it so complicated when you add sims in the game also yasmin or whatever her name is honestly i don't know how to pronounce that i'm sorry um her i uh, her sorry her, her face she had freckles but they're like cc freckles so i don't know why they just added those in and i honestly don't know if she does have freckles or not but I gave her them anyways. Anyways, we're getting really distracted here because we're still on Tina. So yeah, so I am super happy for how she turned out. Shockingly though, I actually prefer Yasmin. Like I love them both. Like they're both icons, don't get me wrong. But if I had to pick, I'd definitely pick Yasmin, which is shocking to me because I love this sim. Like I just never saw Yasmin around, but honestly, I love her. Um, but yeah, so I was really struggling with the hair, honestly, because I was going with like Max's match hair because I thought it suited her better. But I don't know, none of them seemed to be right for her, and I just wasn't feeling any of them. So I ended up swapping out to Alpha hair. It's like this wings hair. It's really cute. I think they both have wings hair potentially. I'm not entirely sure, but I don't know. I really like this hair, and I gave her this little accessory fringe because I felt like she suits a fringe so bloody well. I had to. Um, and then these glasses are super cute because I'm pretty sure she has glasses normally. And then just so, like I said, the rainbow makeup is so cute. I love it so much. So I was really happy when I put that on her because I was like, I was searching for it for so long, and I realized it's right at the top, and I was just being an absolute idiot. So that's my story. Um, but yeah, so I was struggling a bit with the outfit because honestly, I don't really know her style I feel like she's very colourful, but I don't know if she's, like, really girly. I don't know, like, what kind of style she has, honestly. Um, so, I went with this top, which I think is by Alexa, if you're wondering. I don't know if it's, like, a CC, like, I don't know if it's a CC top that's made from, like, a base game model or something, because I feel like I recognise it, but I'm not entirely sure, honestly. It might be from, like, Get Famous or something, I don't know. But it's super cute, and I felt like it matched her makeup a lot. And then, I gave her some, like, flary trousers, because it's me, and we love some flary trousers on this channel. Um. But yeah, so I love this outfit a lot. I think she's out super cute. I just, I don't know, I was really, I was struggling a bit with the outfit, just honestly, because, like, she, I just don't know much about these sims, like, because, like, you know, we're, like, say, making over, like, a Bella Goth or something, like, you know the style pretty well, but this is, like, I guess I just basically made them both my style, honestly, it's embarrassing at this point, but I don't even care, this is the best style, fight me, um, so, yeah, this is Tina, and now we are moving on to, I think, okay, and 
I think it's Yasmin. I'm going to say Yasmin. It could be Yasmin. I'm sorry. I don't, I'm not very good at n pronunciations. Sorry about that, love. Uh, but she is apparently a freelance writer. And she is clumsy, a bookworm, and creative. And she wants to be a best-selling author. Didn't even know that about her until now. So that's great. But oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my, oh my, oh my god. Okay, you know how every single uh, video I make, I'm like, I'm about to simp. Or, oh my god, this is the best-looking townie. <laughs> okay, every single one of those is a lie. This is the best looking sim. She is the pre sim in the entire game. Fight me on that, but I don't even care. She popped off. I don't know how we ever managed to do this because she's literally prettier than any sim I've ever made. I just love her so much. Honestly, I am so happy with how she turned out. I think, like, just adding these skin details, she just looks so good with them and with the freckles and everything. She just popped off. I was like, love, can you calm down? Like, this is, ooh, you know what I mean? Um, I even took screenshots of these two because I am literally obsessed with them. Like, I knew I was going to love them no matter what, but honestly, I've never seen Yasmin before. So, like, I wasn't, I didn't know what she looked like. I was like, that's why I made Tina first because I was like, hope, like, I was thinking I was going to like her makeup over more but no yasmin popped off like she really out here living like oh my god i love her so yeah um so i yeah i, I gave her these skin details and i just feel like it works so well with like her her face and everything and her eyes are so pretty i think that's like the best like i don't know her eyes are just really pretty like i could not make eyes like that in sims i don't know what it is but my eyes in sims they just fail i suck at making eyes in sims they just really bad but i was again struggling with hair I did not know what to do. I was like, should I go to Max's match? And then, like, she sued every single one. Like, you're not, you're, you're trying to tell me she does not sue every single one of these hairs. Like, she sues every single one. So, like, how the bloody hell are you meant to pick when she sues every single goddamn hair colour? And hair colour? Hair colour, Lana. You absolute idiot. I mean, hair style. Like, how are you even meant to pick? So, yeah, that was fun. But I think I might have ended up giving her a wings hair. Honestly, I don't remember. I made these sims last night. It's kind of embarrassing, honestly, but I don't care. Um, but yeah, I just, I don't know what it was, but she just popped up. Oh yeah, it was this wings hair. I actually gave her hair as like a purpley colour because there was no like brown option. And I was just like, you know what? She suits this really well. And I feel like it works really well with her eye colour. So I just went with it, honestly. And she suits it super well. I don't know, like, I get obviously it's dyed. You know, you're not really just born with purple hair. So that's, oh my God, imagine if you were. That'd be so cool wouldn't it like if you if you didn't just have natural hair colors like people could be born with any different type of hair unless you had like green hair or something like i don't know about that love but like i feel like that'd be really cool wait we should do that e evolution can you please come our way please because that would be great uh, but anyways yeah so again i was struggling with the outfit i think i actually ended up giving the two because i really wanted to use this skirt and it wasn't going to suit the first outfit also yes i use this top all the time shut up okay i know you're thinking it i don't care it is the best top it, period okay you know what I mean? It's a really good top, and I can't help it. It's so cute. Um, and I don't know. I felt like it just. I, she just I just, I love these sims, okay? I just love them. So, I'm super happy that they turned out, honestly. Like, I knew I was going to like them. Also, thank you so much to the person that shared this. I'm so sorry, I can't think of who it was. But there's definitely someone that shared this and made me want to do it. It was a while ago, but I'm sorry. I literally don't know who you are. Because I could not. It was a while ago, and I do not. I... <sighs> I'm lazy, honestly, and I'm rushing this video. Yeah, sorry this video's out late as well, uh, probably. I am an idiot, and I've only just decided to do the voiceover, even though I've had this video ready all day. Absolute love that for me. Um, but yeah, so I did give her some peers and stuff. It's kind of funny, because, well, kind of funny. It's not really funny in the slightest, but basically, I gave her a septum piercing, and I gave Tina the, uh, like, a nose ring instead, which I swapped over. Wasn't that wild? I don't know, I just felt like this two, the other, the other one's better. I just... I I don't know what it was um but yeah that's a really cool story Lana I'm so glad I told that um so yeah so I am super happy with how these sims turn out honestly like they are so cute and I love them so much like I want to play with these sims they're so adorable and I want to know what Olive looks like growing up now like I don't know is she adopted I honestly don't know uh, I do not know enough about this family but I want to know because they are beautiful um but yeah so as you can see, this is the skirt I gave her. It's so cute. I don't know if this is a style either, but honestly, I wanted to give it a... It's so adorable. Plus, it's the second outfit. You can ignore it if you really want to, love. But anyways, guys, thanks for watching this video. Let me know in the comments below if you like how these sims turned out. Again, thank you to the person that suggested this. Also, let me know if there's any other tiny makeup you want me to do. You guys seem to like these quite a lot. So, please let me know in the comments below. I might do some others from Eco Lifestyle, even though, honestly, I don't know if there's any more. Is it... I think there's an old couple as well. Uh, I might make them over at some point. But yeah, anyways... <laughs> <laughs> Hit the notification bell if you haven't already. Remember to like, I'm subscribed, do whatever you want. And I'll see you guys in another video. Goodbye, children.